Another story of uh, trans panic here. A snooker champ predicts the end of women's sport if trans women can play snooker as well. I, I'm really having a hard time maintaining my composure on this mm -hmm. because the removal of transgender people from snooker will perhaps be, it will be quite honestly, the Normandy of trans rights. You know, this will be the fight because snooker is such an international God, y'all, I can't even do it with a straight face. <laughs> I, don't even, I don't even feel that's an exaggeration, Jeannie. You, you broke right as I was going to jump in and, and yes and on that one. So <laughs> I can't. I can't. You messed up our, our improv routine. Um, I, I, um, y'all. Y'all. Snooker. Did y'all even know that competitive snooker was a thing? Well, I did. I mean, we had, we had, we had Caitlyn Jenner talking about her last week, saying that golf is a totally different sport than swimming. Yeah, and it's no big deal if if um, trans women play in, in that sport because right. she likes the trans woman that's the trans woman that's playing in that sport. Because 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 golf golf is about touch. It's about feel. Snooker, snooker is about math. Oh, and, and yeah, women are at a that massive disadvantage there, right? right? Yeah, men are so much more capable at figuring out angles and velocities and pressure. Um, okay, moving on. Moving on. <laughs> 